I'm Erica Lopez with your e block today. The impractical jokers are soon coming here to Denver. Creators Q, Murr, and Sal are bringing their outrageous pranks to the stage. Here to break it all down, we welcome Murr. Thank you so much for joining us today. Hi, everybody. <laughs> Thanks for having me. Absolutely. We're so excited to have you in town here soon. Who's behind you there? Who's over your shoulder? <laughs> Uh, well, you might, just my buddy came to hang out. He's uh, don't worry. He won't interrupt the interview. He just is here in the house hanging out with uh, us. You know, he's he doesn't say much, but it's just my friend Nicholas Cage. <laughs> okay. you know? I love it. I love it. All right, Mer, anyone on the off chance that might not be familiar with Impractical Jokers, give us a rundown of, of what we get in an episode of the show. Uh, the TV show is a comedy show, hidden camera comedy show starring my uh, best friends and I. Uh, we compete in hidden camera challenges that are usually very embarrassing and very, very funny. And whoever loses the challenges gets punished in the end in some hysterical way. For example, a few seasons ago, I lost an, uh, a challenge on the show. I lost an episode and they shaved off my eyebrows. Oh. So when I fly to Denver, my driver's license will still look like that, just so you know. Oh no, that is savage. Yeah. So, Honestly, your so show it's is- It's very funny. It is very funny. Mer, your guys' show is so great. How are you adapting it to the stage? What can we expect on May 6th when you're here in town? Uh, it's a hysterical stand-up comedy show. The guys and I are on stage at all times. We shot hidden camera challenges just a live tour you can't see anywhere else. It's kind of like hanging out uh, for a night with your best friends from TV, you know? And uh, we tell stories from the TV show. We show things you can never see on TV that uh, are cut from the TV show. Uh, and it's just a hysterical night of comedy. And we finally tell the story of my wedding. My wedding ended in absolute disaster. And you'll find out all about it on the tour. Okay, that's a good tease, Mer. You recently celebrated 10 years of your show in Practical Jokers. Do you have a favorite prank of all time? Uh, I have a least favorite prank. Uh, <laughs> for one year on for one year on television, I was forced. To, they shaved off Q's hair. He grew his hair unknown to me. Unbeknownst to me, he grew his hair to 14 inches, and they shaved it all off. And they forced me for one year on television to wear his hair as a wig. No, and it looks it looked like that. And uh, I, I don't look good in another human being's hair. So there you go. <laughs> oh, that is incredible. Murr, I can't thank I was, you. I wasn't planning on that. I wasn't planning on that. It was just on my desk. Yeah, That's you, where I pulled the door. You weren't planning on it, but you had it ready to go. Murr, thank you so, so much. We're so excited to have you in town here very, very soon. We appreciate you for joining us. And all of you get to see Q, Murr, and Sal at the Belco Theater Saturday, May 6th. You can get tickets on their website right now in practicaljokerslive.com.